Beast mode. Beast mode. Beast mode. Yo, what up, fam? Welcome back to a brand new video here on the GT Suits YouTube channel. All right, so as we're on this grind. As we're getting closer and closer to finals being over, I told you guys, we're gonna have daily videos on this channel. I'm gonna be pumping out content daily. Top notch, the best of my abilities, the best content for you guys, the most entertaining, enjoyable, informational. This is gonna be the start of the grind. This video, there ain't no crying in boot camp. It's been a while since I started off a video with one of these, so I thought it would be appropriate to do a nice little Firestone 805 chug and memorandum of finals being almost over. Tomorrow's my last final, so I thought I'd give you guys a, uh, you know, a little something, something to get this video kickstarted here. Holy shit, talk about topping it off, boys. Cheers to the holidays for everyone holding down the fort, for everyone standing the watch for me, for letting me be a veteran and be in college and have a nice, safe home. Thank you, fam, for protecting the country. This is for Papa Drip. Oh. Do not chug a beer when you have ate zero food all day. <sighs> Literally, that shit almost came up. That shit almost came back up. I was lit in the in the head, like. Uh, uh. <laughs> Anyways, back to the topic at hand. I've been getting a lot of questions lately this past couple weeks about nervousness going into boot camp about people potentially breaking down and crying, about people freaking out. Lucky for you guys, 2016, 2017, boot camp right now has never been easier. Has never been easier. One, two, three. One, two, three. It's so watered down, the military is so politically correct nowadays, you have fucking cards that they have to bring out. Everyone knows that saying, there ain't no crying in baseball. <laughs> Are you crying? No. Are you crying? Oh. Are you crying? <laughs> There's no crying. There's no crying in baseball. Well, there ain't no fucking crying in the military, in boot camp. Everyone's gonna be nervous. Everyone's feeling apprehension. Everyone's feeling, you know, the same thing. That's how I'm able to come out with these videos. How I'm able to come out with all this content for you guys because I went through it all just like you're going to. I understand the emotions that you're gonna face. You know, something that I've always been is very empathetic. And that in boot camp, you know, that helped me out in boot camp having a lot of empathy because my bunk mate. My bunkmate was one of those people that would cry in boot camp. You know, he was very socially awkward. He didn't know how to talk to people. He was always getting chewed out by the RDCs. He couldn't do any of the workouts very well. But I felt a lot of empathy for him. You know, I wanted him to succeed. I wanted him to do well. So if you're that type of person in boot camp, hopefully everyone around you is gonna build you up. You know, they're gonna help you out. But about the crying in boot camp, you know, those first couple nights, I did hear, you are gonna hear the, you know the sound. It's gonna be completely quiet. Everyone's gonna be trying to go to sleep and then you're gonna hear the the, the hard, deep sniffling, you know? And, and I heard that and I was like, fuck dude, people are actually crying. This shit's getting to them, you know? They, they broke the first couple days. These people broke. God, I don't belong here. We have a winner. Who wanna go home? And it's fat ass by a nose! Riz fist! Riz fist! Riz fist! I don't want to go home! I don't want to go home! I want my mother! Not saying that there's anything wrong with being emotional. I was. I understand. It was my first time being away from home. Boot camp, the Navy was my first real job. So it was a lot of emotions. I know you guys are gonna be feeling a lot of things, a lot of homesickness. That's why, that's when the letters come into play. That's when talking with your family through those letters, that's gonna get you through. Also taking boot camp one day at a time. But yeah fam, the military helped me be become what I am today, the person I am today. When I went in at 18, 
You know, a lot of these comments that I'm getting are the same comments I would have left if there was a YouTube channel like this. So that's why I want to make these videos to tell you it's not going to be that bad. The military boot camp, honestly, you're going to look back at it. I guarantee you, you're going to look back at it with a little chuckle and a smile and like, fuck, like, I can't believe that shit's over with. You know, you have so much to go ahead. You have so much in front of you after boot camp, A school, the fleet, deployment. Life after the military. There's so much stuff to look forward to. You know, get through boot camp, get through the grind. Everybody goes through it. They're gonna turn you into a sailor. You're gonna come out the other end a better person. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just wanted to make this just to help calm some of those nerves out there, um, some of that anxiety. I went through the same stuff. You know, I've dealt with a lot of anxiety my whole life. More videos on that topic to come in the future, but for now, it's gonna be wrapping it up. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Social media below as always. We're on the fucking grind to 50k subs. The channel is crazy growth right now. You guys have been killing it with the comments and likes. I really appreciate it, man. You guys don't know, like, this is my passion. I love making these videos, and it's really exciting for me to see the channel growing and to see all the positive feedback. But, um, hope you guys have a great evening. Daily videos now on the channel. That finals are almost over tomorrow. I'm going to be pumping out the content for you, fam. See you very soon. Goodbye! Last night took a L, but tonight I bounce back. Wake up every morning.